All right, what's up, y'all? Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy, Maj. Here are four quick and simple ways I like to style my two-strand twists and how you guys can also do the same. All right, starting off with number one, real simple. Of course, you can just wear it straight down like it is. Um, nothing wrong with this. You know, I think this is really just like wake up and go type of style. But sometimes, you know, me personally, I don't like having the hair dangling all in my face when I'm trying to do some activities or I'm working out or something. So in cases like that, what I tend to do is, uh, going into style number two, is I just bring it all the way back into a ponytail. If your hair is long enough, then you can achieve this. For the most part, you know, my hair is long enough to um, get it out my face this way. Uh, and it's really simple. You just need a rubber band or something to tie it down in the back. So here's the look um, from the side, side, back. Now you'll notice that sometimes in the front of my hair, it may not be long enough to uh, get caught in the ponytail. So I might end up just pulling these down um, in the front or whichever ones don't get caught. Where usually if I don't want them, you know, you can just take it and tuck it in the hair that's already caught. And that way it will stay tight and stay out of your face. Do it on this side. As you can see, I take it and I just find a little groove and I try to stick it somewhere in there and boom. For uh, style number three, similar concept. You know, you're working out, you're doing something where you don't want your hair all in your face. So what I'll usually do is, instead of putting it all the way back in a ponytail, I'll take just this first half of my front head and I'll try to grab these and bring them up and just bring them back into a ponytail that will sit kind of on top of your head. The only reason I'll do this is if I'm just tired and not really trying to look for a, uh, a ponytail look, but I want something to look a little more stylish or a little more different. So I'll pull it back like this, put it in a ponytail, and then leave whatever hair is down, just laying down like it was. So here's from the side. Here's from the back. So now, you know, you can do what you want to do. If I want to go to the gym, or if I want to do whatever, eat food, and I don't want my hair um, hanging in my plate, then I'll just do either one of those two styles, the ponytail in the back, or the ponytail on the top of the head. So for the last style, like I said, sometimes the hair in the front is just, you know, with the shrinkage. Um, sometimes it just doesn't get caught in the ponytails. Um, so what I'll do is I'll usually just try to pull it back in a ponytail um, and then whatever doesn't get caught, I'll let it just hang out uh, in the front of my face. And that will kind of give you a little more of a different style that you might not be used to uh, just to change things up. So I'll bring this one down. I might bring this one down just to leave two. Sometimes I might bring two down on one side, leave one on the other. You know, this is really, this when it comes to just freestyling, doing what you want to do. Maybe you filling both down on each side or however many fall for you. Uh, you can kind of play around with it and customize it how you want. Um, but I'll show you a 360 look, just kind of how it looks a bit more edgy or uh, stylish. From the top. So then real quick, real simple, all these styles take maybe a couple seconds to create. And as always, you can always spice it up. Um, maybe you wanted to add some cramps or something to your twist and just give it you know, a bit more of a stylish effect. Um, but usually I'll just rock it like this. That is going to do it. Uh, if you made it this far in the video, again, I appreciate you as always. Uh, leave a like, comment down below. Uh, let me know if there's any more hairstyle uh, tutorials or videos you want to see from me. And I'll try to get those created for y'all. Uh, but I'll see y'all in the next video.